I'm here to talk to you about monkey minds. So for those of you who don't know me, my name is Patrick Stahl and I'm the lead trainer at Perfect Life. The monkey mind is the tiny little monkey that sits on your shoulder and says, you shouldn't take that little risk. And that risk could be pretty much anything that takes you outside of your comfort zone. So it could be when you're standing there in a pub or a bar and you're seeing someone and you're thinking, oh my God, that could be the love of my life. And then you hesitate. You think, mm, maybe I should wait for the right moment. Oh shit, and then the moment is gone. The same thing that happens when you, in a meeting, realize that, oh, I have a really good idea. Hmm, maybe I should, mm, or should I propose that idea? Mm, I'll just wait until, to, ah, missed the moment, right? So procrastination is not your friend. The little monkey will tell you that you shouldn't suggest yourself as project lead for that because you're a little bit too young. You're still a little bit too young. And then a couple of years go and it says, you're still a little bit too junior, too young, you know. And then it will say, hey, hey, you're actually a little bit too old now because there's never a sweet spot. The monkey mind on your shoulder is whispering in your ear what you need in order to not leave your comfort zone. So it is your brain. It's your own brain. It listens to what is, what is your reaction to whatever it is that it says. If it says you are actually too senior for this, and then if you respond by, but I'm the youngest one here, then it will change the tune and say, yeah, 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 I, I know that. But uh, you're very inexperienced with this particular version of whatever risk it is it, you want to take. You see, the, the monkey, it adapts. So what you need to do is to figure out which are my monkeys. So when you know that, okay, today in the meeting, I want to present this idea. What will be the monkey mind that will try to talk me out of this? Now, granted, one time out of a hundred, you really should listen to that monkey. Because one time out of a hundred, maybe it is the word of wisdom. If you're going up on that cliff and you go like, I'm going to do the bungee jump, but, you know, without that silly rubber cord, I'm just going to... If you hear a little monkey that says, actually, that's not a good idea, then that's the voice of wisdom. But most of the time, 99% of the time, it is just our amygdala, a tiny part of our brain, trying to tell us to, hey, stay in the comfort zone. Don't do anything risky. Don't risk something then we miss out on so much good stuff. So get to know your monkeys and then tell them, thanks for your input, but I'll do this. Good luck.